Hello everyone, Eric here, and uh, today is the first vlog of 2018. It is January 2nd, and I thought this video would be just a little quick recap video of the end of the year, basically, with Christmas and or whatever holiday you guys do celebrate, and then the, if you are, and then the New Year's. So, to start with the Christmas time stuff and things, presents and all of that fun stuff, which is really not the point, um, to me at least, it's more about giving things back to those you care about most, and, um, the one thing I do want to mention is there's not a particular thing, um, but you can tell, probably, and if you watched any of my other videos, you probably already know this, but I got a new camera, and you can tell here, I mean, I'm looking at it right now, and it looks so much different than it did before, and I have my camera set up a little bit different than before, but we'll see. I change it all the time. I have, like, this OCD thing where I need to, like, make it look better and better all the time. And, uh, <sighs> constant improvement, everybody. But, anyways, the, the thing I did this year and I want to continue to do as a transition, tradition, is with my friends and stuff like that. I didn't, we've never really gotten presents for each other. And this time around, I went and got books for everybody. And I thought... This is like the best thing you can do for someone because it's not like a material thing. And if you know that person well enough to be able to buy them a book, then you know what their temperament is like and something they can gain value from. And a book is like trapped knowledge in the form of they have to spend the time to read it afterwards. So if even if they don't read it, you still gave them something that they can use in some way. Or they can, if they are an avid reader, they're going to read it and enjoy it, and then they're going to always have that. And you never know what a book's going to do for somebody. And I think books are something that are super important for people and have only gotten more popular as time has gone on. Um, with the, the recent um, addition to the Amazon charts and stuff like that, it's just it's just kind of blowing up. And, and all these people like giving their favorite books and stuff like that, it's just really, really interesting. And I, I just really enjoy being able to give someone back a little bit of something because I just think it's important. Um, and then that goes into New Year's, and so for New Year's for me, it's never really been like a super like crazy party thing. I'm not like amazing party guy, as you could probably tell with behind me and all that stuff. Um, but I did go out. We I did have a little bit of like mini vacation stuff and things. But now we're back, and really, what New Year's is all about for me is looking back on the year and figuring out what really matters to me, and. Um, what do I want to keep doing more of or working on more towards? Um, I did mention in my first one that I was a student still and I'm still going to be in school for the foreseeable future because I'm close to the end and being a full-time student slash uh, full-time worker makes my life difficult for scheduling purposes. So that'll be a continuation as quote-unquote education. But... These vlogs are going to be my way of giving you guys more information of the things I'm learning outside of school. Um, and, and one of those things I'm going to briefly show is this book here called Daily Stoic, which I absolutely love. And I totally covered up my mouth for a second there, which was totally terrible. Um, and this book is super amazing, where each day it has like a page's worth of text. And Stoicism as a philosophy which seems weird right because nowadays people's philosophies are getting in the way of stuff has pretty reshaped my life and understanding and how I want to operate in the world and just being able to keep yourself mentally f grounded in a way basically not getting too volatile emotionally or uh, mentally and just in general it just helps you see the the I don't want to say silver lining I guess it keeps you realistic to the terms. And if you guys are finding yourself having issues with clarity, so to speak, I think it's really, really good for you guys to get into. And if you just type in Seneca anywhere or just go to the Daily Stoic, there's so much out there now. And I really, 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 really want to spread this message to you guys because I think it helps just about anyone that wants to use it. Um... And then the last part here is I just want to tell you where the channel's heading. So I was looking at the analytics a couple days ago, and now we've hit 90 subscribers at the last time I checked, which is super crazy and amazing. I never thought I'd even get to 10. So <laughs> the fact that we're here now at 90 and all that stuff, uh, 
I don't, I really have, cannot convey how much it means to me that this is even a little, this little experiment that I just decided to do and somehow has now kind of taken a little bit of a, it's grown its own little legs, so to speak, is weird a little bit. And I just thank you for everything for the last year. I think in the last year we got about 65 subscribers, so that's pretty crazy. I've only had the channel alive for about, I think, a year and a half total now, something like that. But for the most part, it's roughly a year. So that is a huge, huge thank you from me to all of you guys who watch these. And I couldn't be happier with how this has turned out. And I'm still learning, guys. So... What you see is not the end product, never is and never will be. It's always a changing and evolving environment and playing different games here and there, and I wish I want to do soon. And then adding more things like this, like I said, for educational purposes. Give you guys little tidbits and hints and stuff and things that I'm using in my daily life that can make your lives just as great. And I think we can all, if we all did that more, the world would be so much more amazing. So, with that everyone, my little rant has ended for today, so Happy New Year to all of you, and I hope you guys get out there and do what you need to do, because, you know, just do it. Whatever that is, that thing you want to be doing, now is a great time to start, just like any day. So, with that everyone, thank you all for joining me as always, and I will see you in the next one. I will try to make these more and more regular, at least once a week. Going forward through the new year, at least that's the hope. So stay tuned for more, everyone, and see you next time.